Alrighty folks, so we decided to take a little drive to Whistler today. My friend Sven's here, my business partner. So uh, here we are at Blackcomb Village, the Whistler Ski Village. Let me show you what it looks like. If I can flip the camera around. There we go. Look at that. Slopes are not open yet. A few kids walking up and down with their sleighs. Blackcomb gondola. The wizard grill. It is a little chilly out here, I must say. Look at that. It's beautiful up here. So this is where you come and hang out when you're rich and famous and you love skiing, I guess. Look at that milestones grill. Wow. This is quite a quaint little town. We actually decided to take a drive on the Sea to what? Sea to Sky Highway because it looks like a sunny day in Vancouver. That obviously doesn't mean it's a sunny day out here at Whistler. I mean, look at it. The mist and the snow. It's absolutely beautiful. Wow. Yeah, we're going to have to come and ski a little bit. Shit, I, I'm just not very good at it. Struggling to get myself skiing. All right, so this is it for this area. I'm going to, um, maybe we're going to stop a couple other places and I'll get some extra footage. All right, cheers. All right, so um, we parked here at the visitor centre. We're going to go find a breakfast restaurant right now. We've got a Tim Hortons, but that's not good enough. Sushi Togo. Okay, yeah, so we're just going to go for a little bit of a walk around the village. Sorry, let me just lock the car, dude. Okay, so this is the little village in Whistler. Fine jewellery, Canadian diamonds. Pile of snow. Which way are we heading? Um, I can imagine this must be beautiful when it's like fully fucking winter. And almost like um, Vail, Colorado. It is. Just friendly and less expensive. Really? Less expensive? The keg. Fuck, because I mean, right now we're going for lunch, dude. Yeah. Shoppers Drug Mart. Mongoli Grill. A welcome figure. Kitchen and bar. This looks close though. Well, you've been to a keg before, you know? Keg's great. They actually make great margaritas. And a hardware store. <laughs> it's a hardware. We can pub and eatery, Sven. Well, they've got flames going. That one, see? Another giant pile of snow. Thank you. 
La Brasserie. Yeah, La Brasserie is... Uh, everybody's queuing up there. We got a Starbucks. Vodka ice room. <laughs> Still got to get home. The old spaghetti factory. Gotta switch hands every now and again and get one in a pocket. Grab ice cold vodka in the ice room. <laughs> Be hot inside. Okay, this is not looking superbly. Yeah, sports and services, galleries and clothing stores. All the rental shops, there's Black's Pub. Uh, it looks closed still. Uh, yeah, well, I didn't see if it was open. Well, I mean, let's walk over there and have a look. I think we're getting to the point where we're going to need to take whatever is open. Wonder if Connor will still walk around with his shorts. So do you think this La Brasiere is so busy just because it's the only one open or? No, I mean, people are willing to sit outside and it makes no sense. No. Right? Or do they have such really awesome food? That place is open. Or do you think it's just the owner having a drink inside? Please use the other door. Where is the other door? Hey guys, okay, thank you. Open at noon. So let's go grab that. That's in twenty minutes. Yeah. I must say, I'm already warming up from the walk. The keg is up front there. Naked Sprout Cafe, Sven? Something a little healthier? No. <laughs> Not exactly. So the Cuban cigar store, straight from Tampa. Yeah. Village cinemas. 
Mongoli Grill is open. World firm, a famous stir fry. Yeah, it looks like the keg's closed, buddy. That's the keg. No. No, it's the Mongoli Grill there. Go have a look what they have. More Asian. So it's Wade. 